Hey everyone, I'm Victor Frost and this is Thing of the Day, where I bring you something cool or interesting every weekday. And I love robots. I especially love building them. I mean, apart from the satisfaction of putting something together with your own two hands, you are imbuing upon an inanimate object a certain amount of free will. Well, free-ish will. And apart from that, robots are just very handy. They're just so useful for society. Work that is boring, work that is impossible for humans to do. And they also do work that is just too dangerous. There are robots being developed in Japan right now designed to go ahead and clean up the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power plant. But what about one of the most hazardous jobs out there? What about war? Robots in war is a controversial subject that has sparked a lot of ire in the world and a lot of fear. I mean, giving a gun to a robot? That's a little dangerous. Of course, advocates for robots in the theater of war have a very compelling argument. One less human on the front lines. Today's thing of the day is an article on theweek.com all about killer robots, what they mean for society and what they mean for the future of warfare. That's your thing of the day. I'm Victor Frost and I'll see you tomorrow.